G'day guys and welcome back to Rusty's Garage. How's everyone finding out there? Um, I know Big W down here, um, they have got a lot of stock now after the toy sale. Um, the pegs are full, uh, the dump bins are full, front end's full. Um, Kmart at Aspley's hasn't got anything. <laughs> Uh, all the woolies haven't got much at all, um, but yeah, so I think it's going to be a little while until we get the next case drop, um, except Kmart might get it, I guess, Kmart and Target might get them, uh, who knows, but what um, we're going to do is cross our fingers and see, eh? Um, so just a bit of an update on what I've picked up this week. Um, so I've got another of the Mazda RX-3s um, from last year's uh, F-Case and I got a couple of the um, Corvettes uh, in the k and livery um, F-Case as well. These I got from Best and Less. Now I did say last week that we don't get US cards here, but best and less seem to get US cards. Um, so as you can see, this here is the US card, and this here is a um, uh, international card. So you see the difference. Uh, the US cards got English on it only, and the international card has a few different languages. Um, plus, it's also got the F at the end of the number there, um, which is the case card, the case num letter, whereas this one hasn't. So, yeah, international card. Oh, and also, um, the US cards have guaranteed for life above the J-hook, and the international cards don't. So, a couple of ways you can tell them apart, I guess. So, yeah, got a couple of the... Um, C7 Z06 Corvettes in the K&N livery, so not, not not the super, unfortunately. Um, I've seen them sitting together and thought, here we go, my luck. I might get a super, but I didn't, so. Um, so that was the best and less. Um, Pick these guys up at um, Kmart at Burpengary, so. I got another night rider in super pursuit mode, which is really cool. That's nice. Uh, I've got a couple of the DeLoreans or the Future Time Machines, back to the Future Time Machines. So a couple of those. Um, and a couple more of the Gotta Go Treasure Hunts. So um, now this morning I went out for a quick hunt and um, picked up a couple. Um, Christy picked this one up for me the other day, um, so that was good. That was meant for somebody, and then for somebody said no, they didn't need it, so that's all right. Keep it. And to my surprise, Big W had these on the shelf this morning down here, so picked them up. Uh, another 86 and another Skyline. Um, no chase car, but yeah, all in all, good. Skyline's pretty cool, so. Um, so yeah, that's, that's, I guess, the lowdown of what I've picked up recently. Um, yeah, guys, so that's it. If there's anything down, uh, there that you've um, seen on this video that you think you want or may need or we may be able to do a trade or something like that, um, just drop it in the comments below and we see if we can work something out. So nice and easy. So... Um, but yeah, I guess let's get on to this Lego build, eh? So yeah, guys, um, we'll get into this, eh? Um, uh, I'm not really sure which one I want to do first. I reckon we do this guy first. We'll do the big fella. Um, get him out of the road. It's, it's fucking sick looking, so um, we'll get that built. And yeah, we'll have a look at it, because uh, it looks really cool. So yeah, we'll get it out of the box and get it all pulled apart. Let's get started. So we'll start with the 
Minion figure first, I guess. And the minion figure is pretty cool because it's a chip. So that's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's nice. We'll um, leave her hair on her for now. We'll put her up there. So let's get going with this. So, that. So there you go guys, the uh, Mopar Dragster, that thing looks mint, 
That is so cool. That is wicked. Nice. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that big block on there. That's cool. That is so awesome, guys. Um, I don't know. I've got to find somewhere to put this now. Um, that's that's just crazy. Um, yeah, I'm in love with that. That's great. Uh, yeah, so we'll get some um, better photos of these. We'll whack them up and we'll wrap this one up, eh? Um, so yeah, guys, that's the um, the top fueler built out of the Mopar uh, Dodge set. So this thing is fucking awesome. Look at that. That's just crazy cool. A big, big block Dodge motor on there. It's just so cool. It's awesome. Top lifts up. It's just, yeah. Um, I knew it was cool when I first seen it, but I'm in love with this thing, man. It's just so cool. Love it. Got to find somewhere to put it now. So, yeah. Um, I'm thinking I might have to dedicate one of these shelves just to the Lego um, cause. Um, the Speed Champion stuff's pretty cool. I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue to find it, look for it. Um, got the Bronco set. Uh, the Ford set, sorry, with the Bronco and the GT40, uh, and just a few other different ones. There's an Aston Martin set, um, Mercedes, yeah, a couple of different ones as well, so just the singular ones. I think there's a Kona Sig and a McLaren um, that I'll look at getting as well, so um, still got the um, Dodge Charger. SRT to build out of this one as well, so we'll do that on the next video. Um, but guys, I guess if you've liked what you've seen, please like, share, and subscribe. Um, we really do appreciate you guys dropping by, uh, taking that you know 10, 15 minutes out of your day to check out what we've got here to offer at Rusty's Garage Australia. Um, <clears throat> make sure you head over and give the guys at Monkey Shine Lab a like and a subscribe. Um, Andre from the First 117 Network, uh, give him a um, like and a subscribe too. Good score today, mate, out of those consoles. A um, few really good games that you scored out of those, so that's that's um, that's really cool. I never thought of actually, when you buy a console, that someone's gonna leave a disc in it, so I never thought of that. So there you go, um, I guess. Their loss is your gain. So, um, Figure Trap um, and also Chris from Ghostbusters Quick Response Unit. Um, head over there, like all those guys. Um, they're really cool what they do and they're associated with the garage. So, um, yeah, love you guys and yeah, can't wait to see what you got up next. Um, yeah, that's it for this one, guys. So, I guess. Till next time, see ya.